These cars are running over Big Brother. It's Uncle Sam under the axle. I was surprised. I saw it all over the city. All over the whole area, actually. You'll see these black strips making the familiar bump bump under your wheels. Actually, I thought it was a speed trap. Yeah. Really? Yeah. When I, when I see those in the street, normally I slow down. Should you have slowed down? Yeah, I should have. Were you, Are you speeding? Um, just a little bit. I just got you to admit on camera that you're speeding. <laughs> It'll give you a start until you realize the speed doesn't count, the rubber counts. If you're looking at 157,000 on the GNO bridge on a typical day. The Department of Transportation says every two or three years we count, or we're counted by the state, so they have an idea of traffic volume. You may see these tubes for a while, for the next six or eight weeks, and then they'll tend to disappear. You know, whoever it is who puts this stuff down, we can't find them. They're like the wind. They come in, they lay rubber on the highway, and they're out of here. But they have to come back sometime to pick up the pieces. How many 18-wheelers do you think could run over this port break? Uh, About 20. Yeah. Yeah. Not okay. many. You'd be surprised. Actually, these things are surprising a lot of drivers who wonder, what is that where the rubber meets the road? Oh, those are the meters for checking speeds. Yeah. Were you speeding? No. I hear a police car. Oh, no, I wasn't speeding this time, no. <laughs> that guy's not after you, then? No, he's not after me, no. <laughs> well, you got to figure someday it's going to happen. Somebody will put a computer chip in there, hook it up to a cop car, and while you're being counted, your number comes up. I'm Janet Gross, Fox 8 News.